Hey guys, all right, RC here. We are back. This is the season finale. Uh, well, the cup final. Uh, we've already finished out the season, and uh, we'll take a look at that. So we have uh, drawn with Colwyn Bay 1 1. Matthew Thomas scores in the 86th minute, and then we give up a 90th minute goal to equalize. And then against Airbus, who had jumped ahead of us, we beat them 3 2. David Penrith on a penalty. Matthew Thomas, a brace. Uh, they do get uh, two late goals and then a player sent off in the waning minutes uh, as we hold on for a 3-2 advantage. And that puts us in eighth position, which we secure. Uh, so taking a look real quick, eighth position netted us $35,000. Well, you know, any money, any type of payout is nice unfortunately uh we did not qualify for the playoffs i don't think there was something in there uh let's see schedule was that the 21st let me go see if i can find that email here yeah right here bala qualify for playoff conference I have no idea what that means. Uh, if we look at the competition stages, rules, 10 games, teams play each other twice, starts January, January 28th to April 21st of this year. Well, January 28th was when this finished and what did I say April 21st that was our last match so yeah I have no idea what that means unless May 14th May 3rd So yeah, I have no idea. So evidently we're in this playoff, but it hasn't shown up on my schedule. I have no idea. Well, we'll play the cup and then we'll see what happens because we're going to do the uh, end of season awards and everything. So match preview. Also, real quick, uh, let me know uh, possible format change. Just it, I'll see what you guys think. Um, so when we finish a season, like after this, after this match, do you guys want to see the season wrap up at the end of this video? Or would you prefer to see it in a next video, which would also be like a preseason transfer special? Let me know your thoughts on that. Um, I hadn't really thought about it before, but, uh, Lelujo does it that way. And, uh, you know, Hey, I watch some of the big boys. I watch some of the small guys, um, you know, and I'm always looking for new ways to do things. But, uh, anyway, that was something I noticed he did that was a little different. So I'll just throw it out there for you guys. If you would like to see that in a different format where I do the season wrap up awards and then transfers all in one go. That's fine if you if you're okay with the awards at the end of the season, like in this episode, and then do the transfers and a match in the next episode. Up, to, you know, just let me know your thoughts in the comments. But let's get to the match. Uh, I did break out the new tactic, so we are underdogs here. All right, Tipton. I actually want Tipton on the field there. I'm all right with that. Uh, Tipton is right only. Wilkes is left only. So if we reverse these guys, right, inside forward, cuts inside, player's strongest foot is opposite. So yeah, we're going to go with that does look like it weakens us a little bit, but it puts them in the best position for that. And, oh boy. Let's do a comparison. 
Jack Watson. Harbottle's actually the best shot stopper. Communication is important. But at the end of the day, it's down to shot stopping, I think. Let's go ahead and give Harbottle the, the start here. We'll give him the nod. Three at the back. Nervous, nervous. Let's go ahead and uh, give him the faith, uh, the faith lie. I have faith. You can do it. <laughs> oh, my. All right, here we go. We are in red, into Wilkes. There's a cross. Header! Ken Tipton! Oh, I made the right call putting him in. And he puts his 11th goal of the season. Kai Wood with the assist. And we are up 1-0 in the early going third minute. And then Kai Wood right off the assist immediately picks up a yellow card. I'm waiting for one of his teammates to go, hold my beer. <laughs> well, there's a cross in. Oh, and Wilk skies that one. Ugh. All right, let's give him some praise. All right. Oh, a penalty. No. Last time we saw a penalty with hard bottle, he saved two. Oh, he was close. He, Will Woodman, the danger man with the third goal, equalizes. Not sure what happened on the foul, but I guess that's unimportant in the scheme of things. All right, let's tell him to get creative. They are inspired. Uh, we are starting to pick up yellow cards here. Encourage. Mm, all right. All right. We will tell them they were excellent. The early goal was very nice. James Wilkes is not playing well. Go out there and show everyone what you're capable of. Penrus. Uh, I've already talked to him about the yellow card, so that's okay. All right, let's go with the early passion. They're playing with caution. Oh no! Oh, I think oh, I think Harbottle was interfered with. Come on, let's take a look at that. Woodman goes up. Oh, Harbottle flubbed it. Might have been his own man that blocked him out there. Uh, d -d demand more. You know what? I meant to change that. Because I think... I know, I know an attacking is better, but... Oh, come on. There has to be a penalty there. Oh, Liam Ward. Penrith should be taking this. Is that him? Yep. Put it in. Oh, he slots it. Yes. Six goal of the season. Mostly penalties. 2-2. Two, two. Very, very nice. Yeah, for some reason, I know I know that attacking is kind of the, the go-to in this. Uh, but I am, you know what? Ride it out, boys. Ride it out. Praise them. Oh, they're overwhelmed. All right, Bennett plays it deep. Tipton runs on. Another cross. Thompson. Yeah, oh, no, come on. Come on. Was he offsides? Oh, that's... Look at this guy right here. No, that was a bullshit call. Come on. Now, stolen away, and Penrith is going to be hitting the shower a few minutes before the rest of his teammates. 
Second yellow card. Ah, crap. Um, okay. So we're going to go here. And then Bennett. All right. Defensive right. Center, center, left. Mid, left. All right. We'll swap these guys back to their regular positions. Moss is in the center. Thomas up front. I'm going to drop Bennett back here. Actually, you know what? I'm going to drop him there. We'll go three. Now, can any of these guys, Edwards, Edwards can play up. There we go. Can you pass? You do have, well, six. It's not great. It's Moss's passing. Moss has got nine. I have not. Let's bring Gornall in here. All right. I'll just hold them off here for a minute. That goes over. Oof. Oh, I cannot believe that. Ugh. Masa heads it out. Good job. Oh, he is wide open. No, come on in the 95th minute. Oh, I'd be pointing at the board and going, four minutes, dude. Four minutes. Hello. <laughs> Oh, that's brutal. That's brutal. That's a brutal way to lose silverware. Gotta. If we could have won that, that would have been able to tell us right away if reputation would be fixed by taking this step down. Can reputation improve just by overperforming? Like we were only supposed to reach the quarterfinals, we reached the finals. Uh, let's go passionate. All right, they switched off. I gave them the wrong speech. Oh, that's harsh. $52,000. We pay out 2.2. Ah, ah, that was not good. Yeah, I, I think that was a bad call. <laughs> Set the record. Of course we did. 20 red, yellows and three reds. You go, boys. Uh, let's take a quick look at the squad. Dev Center, Youth Candidates. All right, I need to look at these guys, see if I want to sign any of them. I think I signed all the ones that I wanted. Now, he's a winger. He's got, eh. I don't think anybody really had. All these guys were, like, really slow pace. And I was like, yeah, that's kind of a waste. Uh, goalkeeping. He might be worth signing. I know I had already signed some of our youth prospects, but nobody else really looked very good. So I think I'm all right with that. All right, well, let's get to – there may not even be an end of season yet because of the playoffs. So let me get ahead a little bit. See what I can find out, because this is all new for me. And you may not have even played this league before. So I will be back when I find something out that's of interesting note. All right, we are back. So I think what that playoff thing was is, if we scroll down here, there was a notification. Oh, you know what it was? It was not. It was... Uh, it was a match between Card. Here we go. Cardiff met Uni and Jan Dudno, and I think that was the playoff. And if we take a look here, 
European place playoffs, league table. So I think Cardiff Met Uni is going to go over Jan Dudno. If I inter so the bottom team and the top team go into a playoff. So we had reached top of the table for a moment, just miss out on that. So, all right, well, so be it. All right, so I'm not going to offer him end of season awards. Let's take a look. Uh, Ken Tipton, fans player of the season, Daniel Penrice and Matthew Thomas, three players that we've come to know pretty well here down the stretch since taking over. Ashley Gornall, the goal of the season. Massimiliano Massa, signing of the season. And Daniel Penrus, 22-year-old young player of the season. Uh, Club Vision moving forward. Work within payroll budget ongoing. Continue to repair the club's financial damage for the end of next season. Avoid relegation and my contract expires. And then continue to remain in the Premier League. Uh, we will accept that. Uh, so the goal next year is to avoid relegation again. All right, so we're going to go calm. Uh, let's see. I think that's true. Yep, and passionate. There we go. Boom. End of season break. All right, so that brings our season to an end. I think we can say we had a successful start here. Uh, so again, we took over against New Saints right here. We only lost two matches my entire run, so and one was against the winner of the league. That was harsh. I really wish we would have won that, but anyway, we'll have a whole off season. We are going to bid farewell to quite a few players to try to get our payroll in line. Uh, looks like we are committed to spend three fifty. 357 k next year, which is less than $1,000 over the payroll. So I'm thinking, and then it says next season's payroll budget is 395 So we'll actually be about 38000 under that. So I think that's huge. We're going to have to probably go with that. We may have to try to move a few more players, but I won't know until we get to it. So I'm going to dive into the offseason. I will see you guys at the start of next season with our transfer special. Thank you so much. And uh, I do know that you know a couple of you guys have made some comments about what a step back this was. And I agree wholeheartedly. What are we going to do though, right? You know, we've got to see if we can get this reputation fixed. We weren't going to do it at Carl Scrona, I don't think. But, uh, you know, that's what this was. And then again, like I mentioned last episode, if you guys have any thoughts for another save moving forward, I always do two saves a year. So this journeyman will end at some point. Uh, and typically it would be in the next month or so. And, uh, you know, by, you know, usually by the end of March, and then we have a six, you know, five to six month window for our next save. Um, I had mentioned uh, in one of the comments that I was thinking about maybe a Chinese save. Uh, something dealing with China. I've never managed there, and I know they have uh, some really big teams and splash some major cash, but we'll, uh, you know, that's a possibility. <coughs> I did, um, you know, I'm always up to another European save, uh, director of football save, uh, but if you have any type of challenge or, or particular save type that you would like me to consider, Mention it in the comments. We can talk about it, and uh, I will at least think about it because it may be something I've never thought of. Guys, hit that like button for me. Subscribe if you're new, or if you just haven't done it yet. What are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. Appreciate you. Take care.